Okay, people, welcome back. Whoops, let me change one more thing. Okay. I have been experimenting and experimenting with my volumes. Hopefully I found one that is going to actually work. Let's hope and pray. Okay, there is no music on at the moment, but it should turn on at any moment. So, here we are. We are with Caius Casades. We just found him. And now we are going to ask him, why are we here? Okay, every single person that I am meeting is saying, hold on a bit. I'm busy, I'm trying to talk to me again in a few seconds. I have a feeling that has something to do with a mod. I don't think that you will have to worry about that if you don't use any mods. Uh, that is not, not normal behavior. Okay, so he's saying, who told me to report to Caius Cosades? I was told to report to you and deliver a package. So do I want to let him look at it? Sure. So he says the emperor wants emperor wants him to make me a novice of the blades. That means I'll be following his orders. Am I ready to follow his orders? Yes. <clears throat> Good. Welcome to the service. I am a novice, I guess. Now I belong to the Blades. The Blades are the Emperor's eyes and ears of the provinces. Okay, so the Blades work for the Emperor. I can use his bed if I need to rest. Well, that's comforting to know. I can't touch his personal stuff unless, I say, unless he says otherwise. I can go to the Blades trainers to improve my skills. Or, if I'm in a hurry, he can give me orders right away. But he doesn't want me to forget to visit the Blades Trainers. Okay, this is a list of the Blades Trainers. Okay, these three are here in Balmora. This one's Serranus and Caldera. Aldrun. There's these two, and Illoween can be found at Sedanine. Okay, we already spoke to her. I'm just going to click on them, just so I can get their information in my journal, in case I ever need to look them up. And Illoween. Let's ask him about the, some of these topics here. The blades, they're spies. Okay, the blades are spies. Emperor's hidden eyes and ears in the provinces. They watch the emperor's enemies. Look for opportunities, make reports. Okay, they're only one of many guilds and factions in Morrowind. I should know a little about Morrowind politics before I get involved with any of the other groups. Okay, these are all of the guilds and factions. Blades, I'm just asking about Imperial Cult. Okay, they're the ones that worship all the Nine Divines and everything. Imperial Legion. They're like the fighters of the Empire, I guess. And there's the Fighters Guild, Mages Guild, Thieves Guild. I've already joined those. House Telvani. I want to join that when I know I do. They're like the Mages Guild of the area. Temple. We already joined the Temple Guild. We've got to do the Seven Graces for them. Morag Tong. They are the Assassins Guild. But they're completely legal.
he has no idea how to find them. I know I'm, I know I'm gonna want to join them. That, that sounds like a little bit of fun going out and assassinating people. And then there's the Kamanatong. Kamanatong are Morrowind's native criminal syndicate. Tough and ruthless. Connections to the higher ranks of House Hlalu. Kamanatong compete directly with the Thieves Guild for control of illegal trade. Okay. So they're a little more ruthless than the Thieves Guild, I guess. Okay. They don't accept Outlanders as members, so I can forget about them. Uh, House Hlalu. Okay. They're like the local thieves guild, kind of like the Kamanatong, I guess, but... Corpus Disease... Red Mountain Monsters... Okay, just reading a little bit about corpus disease there. It's a little, a little different. House Redoran. One of it's the last of the three houses. So there's Telvani, Hlalu, and Redoran. Or Redoran. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that correctly. Nerevarine. Just gonna. Okay, I think I've clicked on all of them. Let's click on orders, see what he's got for me. Okay, he just gave me some money. Gonna go get a decent weapon and ar or armor or a spell. And I need a cover identity. Around here, freelancer adventure is a common profession. Sign on with the fighters, mages... Imperial Cult, Imperial Legion, advance in the rank, gain skill. Okay, so he's basically... Ask me to go out and get some, do some other things. When, I f when he feels like I'm ready, I'm gonna come back and get some orders. So I guess, I guess I'll come back in a little while. Okay. He's gonna give me orders anyways, even though even though I guess I'm not ready, he's gonna give me orders anyways. I gotta to go to talk to Hasfat Antabolus of the Fighters Guild. Ask him what he knows about the Nerevarine Secret Cult and the Sixth House Secret Cult. I'll have to do him a favor first, probably an ugly favor. Just do it. Get the information and bring it back to him, okay. Hasfat is a student of Morrowind history, so take the chance to get a little education. Morrowind history. Jeanette sits little book on Morrowind history is a good place to start. He has a copy here. Take it with me. I might look for it. On Morrowind, Imperial Province, Sunhold. Okay, he just gave me a book, a Short History of Morrowind. I might read that later. But I have to go talk to Hasfat Antabalas, whatever his name is. Save it. Save it. Go find Hasfat on Tabalas. I 
guess I hadn't checked these out yet for goodies. Let's see if I can grab this. Um, steel flame mace. Is that 63 gold? Rather have the petty soul gems. Potions, nice potions. And didn't get caught. Save it, save it. Okay. How does the day greet you, friend? No. What brings you here, friend? No. Hotspot on Tabales. So I'm with Caius, huh? And Caius wants information. Of course, there's a little this for that involved. He requires a favor first, then he'll tell me what I want to know. There are Dwemer ruins nearby called Arkintand. Wants me to run over there, find a little cube with. A circular design and some symbols on it. It's called a Dwemer puzzle box. Bring me back the Dwemer puzzle box and then he'll tell me what he knows. About the size of your fist, maybe a little bigger. Be made of coppery metal with a particular design and symbols on one side, some line marks on the other. That's all he wants. Just that little cube. It's a little cube. Okay, Arctinghand. Old Dwemer ruins. Extensive on the surface and underground. Head south of town, past the Silt Strider. Cross the bridges east of the Odai River. The signpost head north towards Caldera. Immediately on the right, I'll see a signpost for Molag Mar. Turn right and head up the hill, the old road across the ancient Dwemer Bridge over Foyota Mamaka. The entrance is on the east side of the Foyota, south of the bridge. Turn a crank on the pipe nearby to open the doors. Hmm. Okay. Alma Alexia. And anything else I can ask him? I guess not. Okay. So I've got the Fighter's Guild, i got to kill some rats. How may I help you, Bratton? And then... Let's see, what else was there? Fighter's Guild, rats, Mage's Guild, I have to get that stone flower. Temple, begin the Seven Graces. Thieves' Guild, Thieves' Guild. Let's do the Thieves' Guild one first, because that's right here in town. Now, in fact, I think the Thieves' Guild... And the Fighters Guild are both right here in town. So I'm just going to clear those up first. Running slowly. Okay, this is her. Yes, Breton. What do you want? Hmm. 
that's her diamond. Hmm. Let's see. Can I steal it? Can I steal it? How close can I get? Nope, she can see me. Mm. So close. Mm. Hmm. What do we got? Do I have something? CV Divine Intervention Nada. Hmm. I was thinking maybe Maybe if I can get her to turn around. Sometimes they'll turn around and then she'd have her back to me. Turn around. I don't think I could do it here. Maybe I could. Can I do it? Mm. I think I can grab it right now. I'm going to give it a try. Nope. <laughs> she saw me. Okay. You had your chance. Okay. Well, that's what happens when you uh, try to steal from someone. You get caught, and the guards there, and I basically have no chance of uh, in that situation. So let's reload the quick save. When did I save it last? I think I have to talk to Antopolis Pompopolis again. Did I talk to him yet? I gotta go talk to him again. Alright. Let's go find Antopolis Pompopolis, whatever his name is. Uh oh. Whoa! You may speak. Did you see that big battle? What happened to him? I was hoping he would have dropped some treasure. Looks like a some kind of creature, or bat, or something entered town, and the uh, the guards all. Killed him. Okay. Wait, I'm going the wrong way. Am I? I think I'm going the wrong way. Yes, I was going the wrong way. It will be so nice when my speed and my athletics increase so that I am not running this slowly. Okay. On Topolis. On Topolis. Snuffleupagus. Uh, okay. Favor, yes, favor. We already asked him about this. Arcting hand, it's over there. We read that already. Dwemer puzzle box. <coughs> and Morrowind history. Oh, he gave me a book also on Morrowind. 
so I can read that on Morrowind book. Do I want a puzzle box? Okay. Okay. Ah, save well. it. What may I do for you? Save it. Don't forget to save it. Now I still want that diamond. Mm. I'm gonna get that diamond. I really don't want to. good wishes to you, friend. Really don't want to buy it. I think I can steal it. I think I just need. Yes, yes, yes. This is telling us about the. Error something to say, up here with this. I thought I heard something. I have not. I have not looked at that yet, and tried to fix it. But I will. I'm gonna go down here and see if this Catwoman here has got a. Welcome. Please don't be shy. I'm listening. An invisibility potion. No, I do not have your flowers yet. I don't really need an expensive one. Okay, here's ordinary invisibility. 35 gold, invisible for 30 seconds. Okay, let me uh, let me get my fatigue back up, and I guess what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna purchase this invisibility potion from her and use that to try to steal the diamond from that alchemy lady. But I want to get a better price on it. And I think my bartering skill ability decreases when I have low fatigue. That's why I'm waiting for my... Whoa, that's what I look like. Hmm. That looks uh, pretty scary. Matter of fact, I'm also going to sell her some of these potions that I have. These extra ones. Okay. 34 gold. Let's sell her. These are the ones I got out of the chest. Restore luck. I don't need those. Restore personality. Restore strength. I might have needed them later, but... Right now, I could use the, the cash. Oh, I gotta sell this also. I would very much also like to sell her this extra one. The Master Mortar and Pestle. 2,400 gold. <sighs> but she's only got 800 gold, so... I think that would kind of be kind of be a waste at this point. She'd only give me 800 gold for it. I'm sure I can get at least 1,200 from her. I just gotta wait a little while. Uh, okay, let's uh, make her an offer. Is there anything else I want to sell her right now? Guess not. I got a lot of restore health. That's what's weighing me down right now, all of those restore health and things. Okay. Now I'm gonna go get that diamond.
Do you? Save it, save it. Now I believe, not only can I steal that diamond, but I believe I can get Bunch of this I suppose stuff. I could spare a moment or two. What is that? Mineral chest. Lock level seventy five. Sure, I'm not gonna be able to pick that. Eighty value two hundred value ten. Blah. I could steal some of that. All right, first save it. Interesting. This a is, tourist. This is gonna be a little tricky. Okay. Diamond, diamond. Visibility superb. I'm pretty sure that I'm gonna be able to get almost all of this. Can't get those. That's all right, though. Okay. Okay. Drink the potion. Invisibility. Visible and okay. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go for it and take all of this stuff. Another invisibility potion. I'm just gonna take all of it if I can. The thing is with the invisibility. As soon as I get out of this screen, I'll be visible. So that's why I'm taking all of this stuff. She might catch me. I don't know. I'm going to try it and see what happens. Okay, I got the diamond and a whole bunch of other extra stuff, and I'm going to take this one as well. These are all, that one's worth a hundred, I'll take that one. That one's worth four hundred, I'll take that one too. Mm. Okay, 
I would like these frost salts. But I think I'm good. That was pretty good. Save it. Save it. Okay, now I'm gonna go give the diamond to the Thieves Guild lady. it down quite a bit actually you know what I'm gonna sell all of this alchemy equipment first to Catwoman here I can spare a few moments if you care to talk and I think I'm gonna do another thing down here too I think I'm gonna drop a bunch of my alchemy stuff on the floor I don't think I need to carry it around with me. How fair thee, friend? That guy asks way too many questions. Uh, let's see. There's this one. Uh, this one. Just take one. this one and this one these are my personal ones the other ones I'm gonna eventually try to sell but I'm getting pretty weighted down here so I gotta wait for my fatigue to go back up remember Morrowind is a game of Somewhat slower paced. You gotta stop and think every once in a while. Solve some puzzles. And then occasionally get involved in a bit of dangerous combat. Alright. Baltair. Let us see if she will Baltair. Uh, she's got 487 gold. And this one. Oh wow, that's 4,000. Okay. 487, 353. Cheap fortified luck. Hmm, cure paralyzation. I think I'm actually going to keep that one. That one's a pretty good one. Fire shield. Fortify intelligence. Restore strength. 80. 434. Okay. So she's only got 53 gold there. I think I might be able to sell her this one too. Yes. So making a good bit of gold here. I got 2,600 gold. I gotta sell that. I guess I really need to make sure I get some, at least a little bit of light armor before I leave here. Matter of fact, I should probably get some light armor before I go to and some training gotta be someone who can train me in light armor here your actions precede you I need to buy some light armor and get some training in light armor before I leave here probably before my first battle 
Tidings and good wishes to you, friend. Anything I can do for you? Yes. I am going to sell you my mighty mace. Twenty-five gold. That's all you give him for for that magical mace. That is sad. I am sad. But that's all right. And I'm also gonna drop some of these books in here. Because those are also pretty heavy on Morrowind. And a short history of Morrowind. I might need the seven pilgrimages because I know I gotta do that too. You know what? Let's let's drop this here too. Uh, maybe not. How does the day greet you, friend? All right. What brings you here, Breton? Oh, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. But I looked in these already. I might have. What's this all about? How may I help you? Speak freely. Let's give her her diamond. Yes, here it is. Excellent. Okay, she gave me uh, another potion of invisibility. Okay. Might come in handy. Did I, do I get to advance? Yes, I am now the wet ear. I was the toad, now I'm the wet ear. Habasi wants the key to Nerano Manor. Okay, I've got to steal a key from Andres Nerano. But Nerano's servant, Sovor Tandril, at the corner club, has a key also. No, not yet. Okay. Andres lives near that alchemist lady's shop in the middle of the street okay and so for spends all his time in gold at the council club <coughs> okay so i gotta try to pick some pockets unfortunately my pot pick well i got a 30 sneak i might be able to pick someone's pocket and how are you? Can I help you? Medium armor? No, you cannot help me. You do not train at all. Well met. Gotta be well, someone who can train no me in, in, you? You? in light Greetings, armor. Friend. Yeah. 
Nada. Tidings and good wishes to you. Greetings. And he friend. does not offer any services. Okay. That makes me sad. Warm deed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm ready for it. I think maybe the last thing I'm going to do for this recording session. What is this about? Is to see what I can see regarding the purchase of some light armor. Normally I don't like to buy stuff like that right off the bat because a lot of times you can find Tidings and good wishes normal to stuff like that I here and there. But I'm going to start getting into some combat situations here fairly shortly and I'm probably going to need that light armor. Before I do any business with him, I'm just going to wait for my fatigue to go up. Ew. I definitely don't like the look of that hat. Alright. Let's see what he's got for sale. For light armor. Okay, he's got a few light armor things. Um, armor reading zero, but that's just because my my light armor skill is pretty pretty low. Weight nine, nine. Weight twelve. Mm. <laughs> Weight 12, but that's got a better armor rating. I really feel like I need to train first before I actually buy any of that. Maybe someone. Alright, I'm gonna look around town and see if I can find someone, anybody can train me in light armor. How may I help you, Braden? Gotta be someone. Maybe at one of the houses. Rogue. Can you train me in light armor? Nope. Let's see if we can find someone in the eight plates. Rogue. No. He does training. Light armor. Ho ho, what luck. Oh, and he's pretty cheap too. Only 54. I guess it's because my skill is so, so low. Oh, oh. Uh, I'm gonna choose, I'm gonna go up five skill levels. So there's one, two, three, four, five. All right. So now my light armor is 10. So hopefully... 
helps out a little. I think there's a shop right across here. Let me check out that shop. See if they got a little bit better light armor. Whoa! Fight well. It's nighttime already. See what he's got for sale. Ah, just weapons, but he's got a crossbow. Mm. Oh, that's nice. And I've got those crossbow bolts too. But I've got the bound arrow spell. Only a hundred and sixty gold. Mm. I might come back for May that the later. Wind be on your back. Silver dagger. I could steal it, but kind of afraid to steal anything from him. I wanna might want to come back and buy that steel crossbow. All right, so my light armor skill has gone up. Let me see if I can buy some of this light armor now. Tidings and good wishes anything to your I can friend. Do for you? Maybe it'll be a little more protective. Okay, a little bit more. All right, we're gonna buy this one. And this one, and this one, and this. I thought that was a shield. This is a shield. So I've got everything except I don't have any <coughs> <coughs> gloves or gloves or boots. All the rest of this is all heavy stuff. But I can sell no, nope, doesn't buy that. Never mind. I'll have to find someone else who buys that stuff. 107. Uh, and. And let us wear it. Oops, I think I just dropped it. I did. Well, not bad. Armor class one, which I guess is better than zero, but ah, Welp. Yes, we have once again the blue, the not the blue screen of death. Luckily, I saved it just recently. Okay, rather than take you through all of that all over again, I'm gonna end this here. And then I'll just go retrain and buy that stuff and I will pick it up in the next recording episode. All right, so I will spare you having to do all that again. It probably wouldn't be, I don't think it's gonna be all that much. So, 
uh, I will end it here and we will see you on the next session for some more Morrowind with 120 mods. Okay, see you later. Bye.